And we're back on the show this Monday. I'm Marley Chapman with us from the YWCA. A lot to talk about as far as the holidays are concerned. Marley, welcome. Good to have mm -hmm. you this morning. Good morning. I'm glad to be here. Um, first up, the holidays are coming and yeah. everybody needs somewhere for their children to go yeah, while during the, the children the, are out of the school. Break. Correct. That's right. Um, we will be open December 27th through the 29th and also January 3rd through the 6th um, mm -hmm. for holiday care. Um, we're open from 7 a.m. to 5.30 p.m. for the children to just, you can drop them off okay. and bring a sack lunch. It's just $25 a day, so you only pay for the days that they attend. That makes it so special and yeah. so convenient. Yeah. They do indoor and outdoor games. Mm -hmm. um, we have Christmas crafts planned, so it's going to be a lot of fun. So I can guess people can call the YWCA to get more information on Yes, they can. Um, it's that. a quick little application that they'll have to fill mm -hmm. out, and then they'll be ready to go. Now, those that attended in summer camp, is an application still required? No, if they've already attended with us before, then they don't have to fill anything out unless phone numbers or anything has mm -hmm. changed. What are those dates again, Marley? It's December 27th through the 29th, mm -hmm. and then January 3rd through the 6th. What's happening over at the Turner Street location? We will be open for um, at Turner Street 2. The mm -hmm. hours are Monday through Friday from 5.30 a.m. to 7 p.m. and then Saturday 9 to 4. And it's just a $6 day pass if you want to bring the kids to play basketball or go swimming. Yeah. So we'll be open for that too. Is that just more of a come and go as you like mm -hmm. activities? Yes. Okay. Yes. And do, can we drop off the children or do we need to be They with would the have parents? to be 14 or older, I believe, um, okay. in mm -hmm. order for you to drop them off. Marley, uh, Decades of Women recently, I heard it went very well. Shannon Miller, the uh, former Olympian, a gold medalist, was the featured speaker. Yes, it was great. A we great had night. such a great turnout. Um, it was, those women are so awesome that we mm -hmm. honored um, their speeches. I mean, everybody kind of had tears in their eyes at the end <laughs> of it. <laughs> That's become a big event now. It used it to be really a, a daytime event, and now they're holding it at nighttime. Yeah, we had it at the Holiday Inn downtown, mm -hmm. and it was, it's a beautiful place. It is, yeah. and every year it seems like it's getting larger bigger and larger. And bigger and bigger it is. That's it wonderful. Is. Shannon Miller uh, give a good speech? She did. She's a pretty awesome lady. You know, she beat ovarian cancer, right. Olympic gold medalist. I mean, she was good. <laughs> <laughs> Sounds like she was a true inspiration. Yes, she was. She was, and it's perfect for that specific event, mm -hmm. too. Absolutely. The YWC now involved also in the uh, holiday high tea. It was yes, last we week. actually just did that last week. We yep. did it at the home of Sherry Grant, and she, oh, that house. She's is an amazing, amazing hostess, isn't she? She is. She is, and her house is amazing. Mm -hmm. Did you enjoy the porch? Yes, and it had this big like bed on the front of it. It was so nice. Yeah. I could I could get used to that you could <laughs> easily. As far as uh, 2017 at the YWCA, just more of the same. Line? Yes, um, we have Girls on the Run coming up. Mm -hmm. um, our our spring season will come up. So that is a program for third through eighth grade girls. Right. Um, it's to get them physically and emotionally fit. And then at the end of the program, they run a 5K. Yeah. Um, the schools, if you're interested in becoming a site, then we need them to sign up by December 31st. So that date is coming up if any schools are interested in the area. That's a program also that's really grown, expanded oh. to a number of parishes. It's huge. And mm -hmm. it's so it's such a rewarding program. I mean, from these girls who think in the very beginning, there's no way that they can run a 5K at the end. And then to see them cross that finish line, mm -hmm. it's pretty amazing. It's amazing for them as well. Oh, yes. Yes. But let's go back and wrap up by talking about the the camp, the camp this holiday season. Mm -hmm. Okay, um, again, we're open from uh, 7 to 5.30. Mm -hmm. um, bring a sack lunch, $25. And it's December 27th through the 29th, and then January 3rd through the 6th. We have a lot of fun Christmas activities planned. I've already printed Christmas bingo, so the kids are pretty <laughs> pumped about so that. So check out the YWCA. Yes, you can go on our website, mm -hmm. ywcaalex.org. Thank right, thanks you. Thanks for coming by. Thank you. Good to have you. More to come on this rainy Monday. We'll check in with Timeless Meds Ball. Stay with us.